Hi, I'm Forbes, Forbes McHale, how are you? Um, I'm going to show you my collection of stuff. Follow me. I started collecting these old television sets because people were throwing them away. And I realised that nobody was ever going to make these again. And they were just going to landfill. And what a waste. I've stored them down the side of my dad's house. He's very generously donated this valuable area. Look at this guy. See, these things have been made, these televisions have been made, obviously, you know, since the 60s and the, and the 70s, and been put in people's homes and been uh, a very in, important piece of the furniture, you know, so they were designed to look good. Look, did you see this guy? So, we're only halfway. So, here's the next wall. Here's the next batch. Occasionally, we find the one which is super special. I think this guy's probably still black and white, this one. It's an old western house. It's pretty spectacular. <laughs> that's, that's me and my collection so far. This is only one batch of, of TVs as well, that you can see. Um, this is in Melbourne, at my dad's house in Melbourne. And um, I'll show you where the rest of the TVs are in the next clip, two states away. All right, see you in a minute. The televisions, we're now in Brisbane, as you can tell by my t-shirt. As you can see, I like the smaller ones. Here's a big guy, this is a big one. This is a, a gift from a friend. My whole TV thing started with big televisions. I used them for wardrobes. I didn't have cupboards, so I emptied out eight big televisions like this and put my clothes in them. Why throw things away? Why buy new shelves? You've got stuff that works and is awesome. Anyway. Look! It's like from the Jetsons! And so you can see these guys over here. Uh, they've been emptied out. I've, I've emptied the insides out of them. Because there's something, there's an additional part to the story. So, part three to the story. Ready for the next stage of evolution. So good. Here is my piece de resistance thus far. These are a lot of my friends from Melbourne. I gave these to them as a Christmas present. Um, yeah. Uh, but the most spectacular part is when you do this. And they sort of come to life. Except for Rod Rod's playing up at the moment. But that's okay. Um, yeah. So I collect televisions and turn them into light installations with awesome photography and awesome subjects such as this. Um, 